you are anything like me, you are not going to let this World Series pass you by without picking up some clothing, some hats, some balls, really anything to really remember what has been happening here in Houston. But if you really, really want to remember all of this, how about a jersey from a World Series game? Those can go for well over fifteen to twenty thousand dollars. A ball can also go for several thousand dollars. Just actually a few moments ago, we met with the Astros authentication manager and historian. Games are very busy for him. He spends all of them watching what's going on very closely because especially in a World Series game, every hat, every jersey, every ball, and every bat has to be set aside. Players, the front office, their families, as well as the Baseball Hall of Fame get first dibs on all of that stuff. But some of these items are truly priceless. Take the home run ball that Jose, Jose Altuve hit that took us to the World Series, for example. Well, it was actually a Yankees player. Left fielder Brett Gardner picked up that ball first. He handed it over to the Astros catcher Javier Bracamonte. He had just gotten, he had gotten done with, uh, with uh, Brett Gardner, who was an outfielder who got the ball and gave it over to Javier and told him, hey, have a great series, go beat him, you know, you guys are great. Uh, and then Aaron Judge was out there coming in from right field, and he also gave uh, Javier a big bear hug. And then Javier came over to me right behind second base, right there in the middle of the field, and drops to his knees, you know, and, and just starts yelling and screaming. And I just love hearing that story. Now that Jose Altuve ball is priceless. It is not for sale no matter how much money you have, but hey, why not pick up one of these baseballs? This one right here, 40 bucks. It has been used in the World Series, just not by Jose Altuve. And it's not the one that got us here. So of course, we're just getting started with all of the fun here at Minute Maid Park. The street festival starts in less than one hour. The game of course starts after that. And I'm also working on a couple more stories. I've got a really cool one coming up at 5 o'clock where we went to go visit the gym where George Springer actually trains. You might be surprised to hear how much he can lift. Trust me, it's a little bit more than what I can lift. I bet it's more than you.